Alrighty, guys and gals, what is going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Misty Mountain Gaming Channel. I am Big E, and we are playing City Skylines. It's our third season of City Skylines. Last episode, we put a little office park over here. Uh, but I'm also, I'm very pleased with the this road. What we did here was a little different, and... Um, I kept the buildings off of the road, and look at this, we got lovely walking paths here. Yes, got a little pedestrian path across the highway. People seem to like it, people enjoy it. I guess. <laughs> anyway, I'm looking at our demands here. Well, I was looking at them. We still got a lot of demand for industry or offices, a little demand for commercial, and a smidgeroni demand for some residential. So I'll tell you what we're going to do. First things first, we'll put some offices in here. Dun, 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 dun. I think I left offices. I'm not going to put offices there on purpose. I kind of like that area. A little open area. You don't need to jam pack stuff every square inch. But I'll tell you what we're going to do here. What am I going to do here? I think we're going to put some high res stuff. I want to put some high residential on this side of the road. Is that wise? I don't know. Um, what am I doing here? Let's just actually, I'll fill this in. We don't have a ton of demand, but that will... Um, yeah, exactly. That will what? I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about. Uh, let me put a path in here. I love these uh, this park life nature reserve path. I want to kind of... I feel like I should have done this a little bit different here. Man, I hate taking out those buildings. Also, I can't remember if pedestrians can cross the street. I should know by now. I If I had the traffic manager thing, I could put a crosswalk in here with like stop signs. What I was thinking is just kind of make this more streamlined for pedestrians and just have it come all the way across. But I don't know if they'll if they'll actually use that or not. So, okay. Well, well, what? <laughs> Let me do this then. Uh, turn off my road length, I think is what I need here. No, I don't know what it is. So I'll just turn them all off. Turn them all off. Turn them all off. There we are. I'm going to put a path too close. Still too close. Let me do it from this side. Um, okay, let's do this, actually. I want to come like this. Freeform tool. Make my own path. Just I'm going to snake this around here. Sneak it around. Sneak it around town. Why is that? Usually it connects up like right there. It's okay. That's what this is for. All right. I guess I'm okay with that. Still get a house in there. Um, but that, but that, but that, but let's a little, little commercial area in here. I don't want the high density stuff. It produces a lot of noise. Whole lot of noise. Some shopping right there, perhaps. Maybe a little corner store right there. Some corner stores in here. Okay. How's everyone doing today? I hope everyone's doing well. Certainly do. I'm not doing too bad. It's a Sunday night. Oh boy, we have a fire. Our people, here they come. Here they come. They're all over it. Got a couple of bodies waiting to be transported over here. What's going on over here? I got cemeteries. Yeah, I guess it's not the best coverage, is it? Okay, well, we are going to... I'm going to call a mulligan on these teeny little things right there. I don't really like those anyway. Get rid of that zoning. I should help out. What are my cemeteries doing here? Oh. Well, that's part of the reason I was actually emptying both of these. This is this thing I 
really dislike about cemeteries. I wish there was some other option in the game. I mean, I could turn it off, right? But if I turn it off, then I get this. I get this flashing thing, and it just kind of bothers me. So you constantly have to empty it. And I don't like it. <laughs> okay, I'll tell you what. I'm going to put a yoga garden. I don't know why. I'm just going to put a yoga garden here. I'm going to connect a path. And I'm going to connect this. And then I'm going to empty that. Yeah, it's really super inefficient. <laughs> put it mildly. What I could probably do, um, let's put a path through here. I think what I could probably do is I could do a custom, I could load this into the asset editor. Wait, look at the wonkiness here of the train. I can load it into the asset editor and I think I can change the capacity. Like make it 30,000. I wonder if I can remember to do that. It would be it make a little bit more sense, I think. I don't know. Anyway. How else are we doing here? Let's check in on the coyotes. Let's see our ridiculous five and one. We're doing fairly well. However, if we lose a game, we're going to be four and two. Yeah, that's what happens. Stupid. <laughs> um... I kind of wanted to do some parking in here, but I don't have my parking. Oh, hello. I don't think I have, I don't think I have any of my custom stuff anymore. Hypermarket. Yeah, I don't. Parking spaces? Wait, can I just throw these in here? Does that actually work? I'm curious. I'm probably going to remove these. But I just want to... Oh, I hate it. Yeah, I don't. I also don't have my... Um, what is it called? The brush that lets you paint pavement and stuff. Get rid of that. I don't like it. I guess I'm not going to worry about the realistic parking here. But we need to do something on this side. Let's do it. have a little focus over here. Kind of a nice little area. Um, I really dislike... I don't want parking on this road here, so I'm going to... What did I use here? Oh, that it's that one. This one does not have the parking spaces. What do you mean I can't upgrade? Is that the one I already have? Oh, that's the one I already have. Um, does that have parking spaces as well? Apparently it does. It is two lanes. Boy, I really need to get my um traffic manager thing. Well, I may as well switch back then. If it has, um, if it, oh, I see, I see. It's that one. I, I want to do that. It needs to be two lanes. So this one, that big avenue in the middle or whatever it is, people can actually walk down that, but you you lose a parking or a uh, a lane. This is pretty inefficient right here. Oh my god! Look at traffic here. I'm not liking that. Do I have a light here? What's going on? Let me see. I think it's just backed up. I have a stop sign there. Yeah. Don't need a stop sign there, I don't think. Maybe that'll help. This road is overkill. I don't know. Maybe it's not. That's It's a pretty major thoroughway thorough right here. Thoroughfare, whatever you want to call it. Is this a light? Stop signs. 
that feels okay. I don't know. There, there, there would be a stop sign here. A six-lane road into this little smaller road? Yeah, I think there would be. But this is not working for me right here. And it could be... Are we playing a match right now? No. But it looks like we're getting ready to play a match. Maybe that's where this influx of traffic is coming from. It's actually flowing a little bit better since I took that stop sign out. So this might resolve itself. And honestly, I probably should get used to seeing traffic because that it, it's, that's realistic. If you're going to a major sports game, you're going to have some traffic on the highway. And I think we're getting ready to play here. Um, next match is 6-4, 2040. I guess we're getting ready to play. Uh, maybe people come three months in advance. I don't know. <laughs> It does bug me, though. So I could streamline this. I could create another. The problem is if I put another road in here, I would just move this problem down here. So I think I'm just going to leave it. It actually looks like it's getting better since I took that stop sign out. People are kind of flowing. Flowing and showing. Now, what I actually what I could do here, let's do this. This makes more sense. I'm gonna do a, I'm gonna do a one way road here. We're gonna do this. God, I really hate the the, the directional arrows. How they never, <laughs> they're never, almost never correct. Nope, that way that way so now we have a double this turns into a double you can turn either way that actually should help out a lot yeah so you can pe see people now using this lane okay i like that yeah this traffic is gone should have done that initially huh all right that feels better yeah the one-way systems do help they can help like, your lane management and stuff Okay, what am I going to do now? Uh, we were going to do something else here. Do I want to put anything else? I think we need some. We need a unique building here. What do we want? I don't think I want a department store. Although what that would kind of make some sense. It'd be a lot of extra traffic. What else do we have? Hypermarket? Nah, I'm not feeling a hypermarket. What else do we have? Let's see if we can find something kind of cool. Transport tower doesn't really make sense. But I kind of like... Are these... Okay, these are offices. Yeah, I have no residential in here, so the noise won't, shouldn't be too much of a problem, especially for the offices, if I wanted to put something like that. Mall of moderation, I don't really like the way that fits. So the transport tower is a potential candidate. Here's my office. <laughs> Official park. That's kind of cool. This is kind of a cool building as well. A grand mall. It's a little bit too close though, isn't it? I feel like it is. It doesn't really fit there either. That doesn't really work. A grand library doesn't really work. That doesn't make any sense there. Although I, I like the observatory. An opera house. Oh, that doesn't fit. Look at this, though. It actually fits over here kind of nicely. Let's put an opera house in there. Yeah. Wow, why is it... What the hell? Why is it all jacked up like that? Can I lower this? Yeah, that's really weird. Interesting. Yeah, that sets up very high. I mean, it's on an awkward piece of land, but it's not that awkward, is it? Also, this needs to move. Let's see if I can get away with pushing this back a little bit. Let's 
So I don't know if you noticed, this isn't centered and this is driving me crazy. This is not centered here. So I guess I'm just going to center that. Does that still work? The description is, it's an opera house, bro. What else do you want? <laughs> okay. It is an opera house. We are covered water-wise here. So that's going to generate a little bit more traffic. And I'm also going to put some pedestrian paths. Actually, let me, let's do something here. I want to move this back. Because this is the weirdest looking thing. What, like, what is this? This looks more like some kind of space museum than it does an opera house. It's very odd looking, but we're going to leave it. Anyway, um, pedestrian paths. Freeform tool, yes. Stuff off. What I'm going to do is try to tie in. I'm going to tie in here. Actually, we'll do a straight tool here. Ah, oh, I knew I was going to do that. Okay, do it from here. I see. Right there. Right there? Yes. So I'm going to do this. I'm going to tie in, put it all the way to here. Actually, just make, this, make it all the way around here. I'm gonna come way past. That way I can tie in right here. Don't mind that. Yeah, you can't actually this you can't actually get here. That's as close as you can get it, which is weird. But that's tied there. Yeah, I guess it is. But now I can do this. Now I can take this and I can move this back. And maybe I can put that path on the other side as well. Let's see. Uh, we got this weird concrete here, though. Yeah. I, oh, I can. Nice. I guess I like that. Let's de do some decorating here. Do some custom decoration. Do we like these? I think we like these. Uh, oh, I can't get it in there. Just barely. Want some palm trees? Do palm trees make sense around an opera house? I don't know. I have no idea. Those don't make sense here. Maybe some flowered bushes? What do you guys think? I guess somebody walking their dog? It's nice to see the paths are working. I guess we'll just do this. I could use my line tool here. But I'm not gonna. I don't think I can get it there, can I? No. If I had Anarchy, I could. I don't have Anarchy loaded in yet. I can get some stuff along the front here. Let's pick some small hedges here. That's not a small hedge. We need to go here. I could also put some cactus. Do I want to line the road with cactus? I don't think I do. I think I want to line the road with something small like this, and I'll use my line tool. And I should be able to do... Uh, well, we'll go to here. Ah, uh, yeah, it's too close. Can I place them one at a time? I can place them one at a time. That is a fine line between you can place it and you can't. Oh, I actually can't get it there. I see. Okay. Wow, look at the people. Oh, they're coming from the game. So if you look at our people, they've, they're all wearing our team colors here. Kind of cool. They're taking advantage of that path. Did we win? We're still five and one. Maybe the match had just ended. I don't know what's going on there, but so that so we're gonna have all this extra traffic, but I don't mind it. It's normal. Okay, well the opera house looks okay, I suppose. Doesn't look too bad. Let's see if I can squeeze a couple of bushes in here. Can I? Uh, oh, oh, yes, yes. We have two there. We have two there. 
And then over here, I think what I'll do, what do these look like? These aren't too bad. Let's use our forest brush for here. For this area, we'll just forest brush this. Let's do some of that. We'll do some of that. If you want to do some of that, why don't you do it? I'm doing it. I'm currently doing it. All right. Opera house. Successful. But I do want something here. And what is this? That's a fire station. Does a fire station work there? Not really, but... Well, actually it does, because if they had to get in here and there was traffic, I feel like something would burn down before they'd be able to get in. So having it in this area feels okay to me. What is this nonsense? What the fuck is happening here? How is this a spawn point? Is it... Is it from... Oh, they're spawning from the opera house, I guess. All right, I need my what you call it mod where I can change the spawn points, I guess. You just kind of have to look past stuff like that a little bit in the game. <laughs> but let's put another unique building in here. What is this thing? Pyramid of safety? <laughs> okay. What does that look like? Oh, we've used this before. Is it elevated as well? I can dig that. That feels pretty good. Kind of cool. Maybe. That's cool. Uh, we got to get some water. So I'm going to cheat here a little bit. I'm just going to run across the road like that. And I'll run across the road like that. The road. The, uh, the area, I should say. This really should be a stoplight. I'm going to leave it. I'm not going to mess with it. I have to get used to traffic. Traffic is normal. You should have some traffic at some point. Okay, this area is feeling a little bit better than it was. Let's take the density down a little bit because it was a little bit much in there. But let's try to fill in here a little. Loading, putting all these trees in here does, it will affect your game performance when it's loading up. And especially if you're doing like these kind of scenes, the more things you have loaded into the game, it will get more sluggish. So using a tree brush, it can work against you, but I do like the way it looks. Not sure our theme is, I don't know, I guess it is pretty wild and scrubby looking, but I think that's what I was going for. So we'll just leave it for now. Anyway, what do we got for demands here? Uh, we have a little bit of office or uh, industry. A little bit of commercial. Got a little bit of shopping in here. Do I want more shopping in here? This might not be a, ba a bad place for high density shopping. I don't want to zone up to that road. We're going to do this. Make that one way. And I'm going to go to there because I may actually want to extend the road. I think that's our first bit of high density. Yeah, that's... Is that regular? Yeah, that's regular. This is our first high density commercial area. It makes a lot of noise, but there are no build, there are no um, residential here, so they should be fine. It also might look kind of cool here. We'll see. We have paths, so people who live over here can potentially walk over here to work instead of driving. All right, that's getting eat up pretty well, pretty nicely. Let's also put some more on this side and I'll leave space to extend the road if we desire. We might desire to do such a thing. 
Yeah, kind of a neat little area. I mean, it was a, a, um, initially the university area, but it's kind of, it's a hybrid area. Yeah, it's what it is, hybrid. Okay, we need a little bit more office and or industry. And do we want to come down further with this? Well, we could fill in this. Let's... Looks a little bit weird right here. Um, I'm actually thinking about a bridge across this. Is that actually, I think that's lined up. These are lined up. So I could potentially do this. I wish that elevate, I wish the elevation step would stay at this lowest elevation. I really do, but it doesn't. One, two, three. Let me see if I can do this. So we'll get over, and then we'll go down. I think it's 11. It is 11. This one's not good. This is going to be a little bit steep, but I think that's okay. Now, if I wanted to, I could, do, I could just match these up, and I think that's what I'm going to do. So what was that? 820? So let's do that. Let's get rid of this. Come out 820. Uh, I got to turn my road length. Is that what it is? It is. And how oh, is it grid? I don't want to snap. What do I click to not snap? Angle? No, it's not angle. I want angle. Oh, it's road guidelines. Okay, I'm just learned that 820. Why can't I hit 820 here? Oh, right there. Okay, that's what I want. Okay, I'll have to remember that. Will I remember it? No. But now this is the same length. It looks a little bit better. And that'll also allow me to zone in here a little bit. And I don't think I want to zone up to there. But we can do that. Yeah, I don't feel like I want to zone on this road, even though... Well, that one should be fine. Definitely don't want to zone on the collector road here. Doesn't really put a lot of... <laughs> doesn't put a lot of extra commercial or uh, um, industry in there, does it? But... Kind of rounds it out a little bit. We have a little bit of space over here. This needs to actually come back, I think. I don't think we want to come over this way. Take that thing down. Boy, this thing is really fucking finicky sometimes. Um, I need this. Yeah, this needs to come back to this side of the road. This is actually what I wanted. There we are. Okay. How's that feel? Feels okay. Nice and nice and tight in there. Victoria Hills Prospect Logging Area. Prospect, even. All right, what are we doing on time here? About a half an hour in. We're creeping up on the next milestone. Yes, we are. Let's take kind of an overlook here. I feel like I need to do something down here, but we're kind of late in the episode for me to start. To start down here. Is this actively being used? Passenger service last week? Zero. <laughs> we have one passenger. You're talking about a waste of money, bro. I think I'm going to turn these off right now. Passed your service last week, none. We're gonna turn this off for right now. So I wonder if these, what will happen to these boats? They should despawn, right? Go back to their the harbor? I don't know, we'll see what happens. But it just doesn't really make any sense to have the boats running. So maybe these are already in route. Maybe he'll re despawn when he gets over here. We'll see what happens, just gonna leave that. Looks like our pollution is still slowly clearing up. It does take a while, doesn't it? I'll tell you what, before we end it, let's 
let's at least dress this up um, to make it look like kind of an industry area here. And I'm going to use the industry, small industry road. Kind of makes sense in here, I think. You can use that as a guideline. That's kind of nice. Just to kind of, you know, give it the feel that this is a treatment area. And people might work here. Let's come across that way. We'll divide it up. We don't really necessarily need... Oh, I also have to think about this area. So I don't want this... I don't want this too big. But maybe we can tie this into here. Because this is... Actually, I may have this area super unique. Like, no road access. You can only get here by ferry. What I might do is change this ferry point. I might move this ferry over to here. Which might generate traffic. Especially if we put some attractions. That would force people to use the ferry. That is the new plan, in fact. But let me see what we have for... Let's see what we have for what? Let's see. Industry, maybe, is what I want. I want some kind of generic stuff. We have nothing. Okay. Um, I think I would need to look in props. What we got here? What is this? Oh, we can, like, place people? <laughs> Oil industry worker marker. Oh, that's interesting. It indicates where workers will appear. All right. Um. Yeah, okay. I don't really know what I'm looking for here. Get Just let me just get rid of that. Let me look. Okay, I guess this is what I want. I want stuff like this. I think what we put over there I just had some like some generic buildings. Let me look in here. Uh, these would flash at me. Let me see. What am I doing here? Um Okay, I think this is I want something like this. I just want the appearance of of like a working area. Guys are like, boy, you're really making some sense, bro. I know I'm not making any sense. Uh, let's go ahead and God, that's so terrible. But it is piped in there. Okay. Yeah, I mean, it's not real good looking. What else do I have? What is this? Let's put this in. Oh, that doesn't fit. Okay, this... Okay, hold on. Move this over here. I'll redo the... Um, I'll redo the pipes here. I want these things in. I want one on each side here. I want that. And I want this to move... There. I want this one to move... There. All right, I want to redo the... Redo these. No, 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 no. I don't want to delete that. Just that. 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 This needs to be redone. I need to pause while I'm doing this, I think. Uh, This. Water pipes. I know it's terrible. I know it's terrible. Connect that there. Okay. Does that make more sense? Is that going to go blue? It should. Why isn't that one going blue? It's connected. Hello? Should I not worry about it? And try again? There we go. I just had to fast forward a little bit. Okay. Okay, so that looks a little bit better. This looks like a treatment area for sure. Mm-hmm. 
And then, yeah, I do like my new idea of moving this ferry over to here. And it'll just be between here and here. We'll extend our little beach area, boardwalk area, whatever we want to call it. What is that? Oh, a little tree. And we'll have some... These things are actually still running. And why are they still running? Do I, Maybe I need to delete... Let's delete the line for right now. Uh, I think I just do this. Go into here. Very line. Delete. What is this? Oh, I need to do... Okay, I'm going to leave that. We're going to delete this one. I don't know if I need to delete this one, but I'm going to. Because we're going to redo this. Boy, surely there's an easier way to do this, right? Can this thing fuck off a little bit? <laughs> So that, they should not run anymore, right? That should get rid of the, yeah, the fairies are now gone. They're going home. This is where I want them to go. Okay. Okay, so they just go, right. That's what I want for right now. And I think what I'll do, we're gonna move the, move the boat museum. We're going to put this over here on this aisle. And we'll kind of, I'll try to separate this. I may use something like a, uh, a flood wall just to kind of give the appearance that this is separate from this area right here. But we're going to have to do that next episode because that's going to be probably a, an entire episode of, of amazing design by yours truly. And the water here, I, I've got to get rid of this. This just looks too weird. Well, I'll redo that for sure. It's not being used. Just going to do that for now. And I'm going to terraform out here a little bit. Maybe make this a slightly higher cliff. Maybe a little bit closer to that. And then the beach. Well, we don't really have a beach area. Maybe I'll leave this a beach. I don't know what I'm going to do, but we do need to wrap it up. We're making great money. The city's doing well here. Let me make sure I don't have anything jacked up, like my budget. I have that jacked up. I want that jacked down. Why did I have that jacked up? I think I went the wrong way. I think I meant to go this way, but I want all this stuff here. Make sure we don't have any loans. We don't have any loans. Everything should be 12%. Actually, this needs to be 12%. Let's bump all this up. I forgot to do it. A little more income. Your citizens will tolerate 12%. For anybody who doesn't know, you go down here into economy, go to your taxes. You can crank this up to 12%. As soon as you're able, and you can get yourself a little extra money. If you go above 12%, you will see people complaining, and eventually people will move out of the neighborhood. Now, I think there is a thing where if your land value is super high, like this bright green, I think you could have your taxes even higher if you're like some kind of miser who wants to squeeze every cent out of their citizens. I think they will tolerate it if it's up here, if your land value is high. But like people back here, they wouldn't tolerate 13%. Uh, yeah. So, okay. What are we doing on uh, cruise lines here? <laughs> two of 100. <laughs> this one has 32. Okay. All right. Anyway, let's do that. I hate it when the camera does that. Do a little city tour here. Hopefully get some good views. Anyway, thanks for hanging out, everybody. I appreciate it. I'm enjoying the season so far. It's coming along nicely. We had a major, major disaster where I flooded the whole entire area. But that's what a save point is for. <laughs> anyway, you guys and gals take care. I will see you in the next episode. Peace.